Hey, what's going on everybody? Um, shooting a quick update on the tank. Uh, so, as you can see, I have a completely new aquascape. Um, it was just too much rock in the tank before. I just didn't like the way it looked, so I made like some, some platforms, like some overhangs down below caves, and a few swim throughs, but I made it more look like an island. Um, you know, it kind of, it kind of like, goes up at an angle and when I put some coral up at the top it's going to fill in but as you can see you know my tank is it's empty all the fish are gone uh, I lost everything everything that I put in here uh, the only two things that survived were these two clowns that's kind of ironic uh, my tank got clownfish disease and the only survivors were the clownfish, which is, which is crazy, but, um, never want to go through that again. So, I do have some new members in the tank. I know you've probably seen their fins, like, swimming around, but, uh, I have a couple of angels in here. Uh, I got a bicolor and a, and a coral beauty. Uh, and my lawnmower, my lawnmower blenny made it. Um, and these, these two, cor these two angels... I might have to get uh, rid of one of them. I introduced them at the same time, and I've done it before, and I didn't have problems, but I think they're two males. So since I have two males in the tank, uh, they're wanting to fight. Uh, but we'll see how it goes for the next day. It's not to the point where uh, it, they're fighting constantly like tanks do, but uh, they are nipping at each other and trying to fight for dominance. I have a clown goby, which survived, and I have a lawnmower blenny, um, and he's right there. He's doing okay. He's still alive. Um, but yeah, my tank's been recycled. Uh, I purged it out with, uh, you know, some of those um, foam pads that take up medication. I did like a bunch of 80% uh, water changes. But everything else is okay. Uh, so I bought a Sally Lightfoot crab and uh, put that in here uh, the day before yesterday. Yeah, the day before yesterday. And he's been alive for two days, so that let me know that it's safe for other inverts. So I went back to my old tank and uh, went over to Daniel's house. And uh, I picked up this cult coral. Uh, it's uh, from the mother colony. It, it split off. And I got one of those little hairy mushrooms right here. And uh, I got a couple of those green, uh, green tentacle leathers. The neon leathers. There's a frag right there. And also... Uh, Cleaned up one of his corals, having some rot and some dead tissue, so I went over there and cleaned it up for him. But uh, if you're watching, thanks, Daniel. I appreciate the frags. And uh, that's probably that's just about where I'm at, though. Uh, everything else is uh, it's uh, it's coming back together. So you guys wish me luck, and uh, let me know what you think of the new aquascape. And uh, let's just keep moving forward. We'll keep putting more coral in here as the months go by, and. Uh, Pretty soon this will this will be a full on reef tank pretty soon. Well, you guys take it easy and uh, this has been my update. Peace.